Hey guys, what's up? This is Cameron from AppOSX.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to enable or disable uh, multitasking and the home screen wallpaper on iPhone 3G and iPod Touch 2G. As you know, these are not enabled by default in that they require you to jailbreak your device to enable them or disable them. So um, I'm going to show you how to do that. So a lot of people have been wanting to know how to disable it because it won't work or it's really slow. So let's just jump into it. So you need to download two programs before we can uh, before we can start. The links will be in the description. You need to download iPhone browser. It'll be 1.9.3. That's in the description. And plist editor for Windows. Um, so now we're gonna go to uh, iPhone browser. Make sure your iPhone is plugged in via the USB port. It's plugged in. Just I'm recording with it. So now we're gonna go to. Let me um, jump out here. Let's minimize all this so I can show you how to get there. Boom and boom. So once you're at the root folder, you need to go to system, hit the plus, library. You're going to go to core services and you're just going to not hit the plus but hit the name springboard.app. Uh, let it refresh really quickly, probably takes about 5-10 seconds depending on uh, your computer. And now we're going to look for a file n82ap.plist. And there it is. This one, not, don't be confused with that one, n82ap.plist. What we're going to do is click it, then right click it, save as, and save it to our desktop. I already have that file, it's just asking if I want to replace it, and I'll hit no. So that's what you do. Make sure you save it to your desktop. This is just an easy place to access. Now what we need to do is keep that open and go to plist editor. So we're going to go to type it in, open it however you'd like and we're gonna go to file we're gonna go to open and we're gonna just since it's I'm already on my desktop searching I'm gonna hit N and it's gonna find the file or you can also scroll through it just a little trick and here's a bunch of code it may look like I'm not sure exactly what it is but it's just some um, keys to enable or disable something so you see accelerometer or key accelerometer equals true so that means it's enabled um, don't disable that, but um, so here you can see home screen dash wallpaper is enabled because that's what it is on my iPhone 3G's I showed you in an earlier video. And there's multitasking true enabled. So if you want to disable these, all you have to do is highlight them and delete them. Um, only delete from the key and the line below it that says true. Um, now if you want to add these, it's as simple as following the same format right here put um, carrot key carrot um, home screen dash wallpaper for the home screen multitasking for multitasking uh, carrot backslash key carrot um, carrot true slash carrot um, so that's how to enable it so there's how to enable or disable it now when you're done you're gonna go to oops I mean to click that uh, okay now when you're done you're gonna hit save so now it's uh, saved on our desktop. So now what we need to do is we need to go to iPhone browser. Back to iPhone browser. We're going to hold this. We're going to right click. We're going to delete file. Um, are you sure you want to delete? Yes. Now do not reboot your phone without this file or else you will have a lot of issues. Um, so now we need to go to computer. We need to go to users. Nope. Cameron desktop and I'm gonna find that N82 file in here there it is it'll have a little like quick time icon next to it so what we need to do is pick it oh well that was a fail you need to pick it and drag it onto uh, this window what we're at an iPhone browser in that directory so we're gonna hold it it's gonna say uh, refreshing whatever so let it refresh and then when it's back in there it'll have your updated wallpaper and home screen wallpaper preferences if you would wanted them or did not want them um, so um, by the way just a little quick note this is our last video with um, a bad camera um, we have our iPhone 4 here as in shown in an earlier video so we'll be using this for now on but we're waiting to do an unboxing 
but um, please rate, comment, subscribe, and um, if it's follow us on Twitter too, it'd be nice to follow us on Twitter for uh, quick updates. So thanks.